Darshan Munidasa, Sri Lanka's internationally recognized chef and restauranter, established Nihon Bashi Restaurant in 1995 at the age of 24. Members of the clergy, Honorable Prime Minister, distinguished guests, fellow recipients, ladies and gentlemen, good evening. It is an honor to share this stage with charismatic, iconic, brilliant, gifted, pioneering, and inspirational Sri Lankans, whom I admire and respect greatly. I did not start uh, study the art of cooking, which translates to Kama Sutra in Singhala, but opened Nihombashi with my mother 22 years ago. The import structure then was not conducive to importing ingredients. And incidentally, Honorable Prime Minister, nothing has changed. <laughs> the trade barrier made me look for alternatives. And I found $2,000 100-kilo tuna destined for Tokyo's famed Tsukiji fish market at the fisheries harbor in Mutuo. I was then told that I couldn't buy this fish as the government did not permit a sale in rupees as it was depriving Sri Lanka of foreign currency. I believed we should serve the best of our tuna in our country. And despite this restriction, we became one of the few restaurants in the world to purchase tuna whole and not purchase tuna in packs or cans like restaurants in Dubai or London. Our crabs were much sought after in Singapore, but not at home. Again, we exported the best, and as Sri Lankans, we had the second best. We should have been having the best of Sri Lankan crabs and not the ones rejected by Singapore, which has been the mantra of Ministry of Crab, probably the most efficient ministry in Sri Lanka. <laughs> Our natural resources are a tremendous asset. The crustaceans we serve and export need study, and the Ministry of Crab hopes to work with National Aquatic Resources and Development Agency, NARA, to bring attention on harvesting, transporting, exporting crab below 300 gram and female crabs with eggs to ensure sustainability. Honorable Prime Minister, we now need to protect the brand Sri Lankan crab. I see an increased number of restaurants in Singapore falsely advertising and serving Indonesian, Filipino, and Indian mud crabs disguised as Sri Lankan crab, and sometimes even Dungeness crabs from the US. Nihonbashi, Ministry of Crab, and Kama Sutra have collectively cooked over 100 times in more than 10 countries over the decade and a half. I am proud to have taken our cuisine, our crabs, our dishes, our ingredients, and our culinary teams to the far corners of the world, from London to Tokyo to Sydney. I would like to thank Mati and his team for this recognition and congratulate them on their 20th anniversary of Business Top 20, recognizing Corporate Sri Lanka and this year for recognizing Brand Sri Lanka. Thank you. <laughs> 